Hey guys, this is Spencer from Pixel and Bracket, and in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create any sided shape in Adobe Illustrator. Here we are with a new 1920 by 1080 artboard and a little orange background for color. So what I'm gonna show you in this tutorial is how to create a shape with any sides in Illustrator. What I want to use is called the polygon tool. So normally over here in your uh, in your toolbar, you're going to see the rectangle tool. You might even see the rounded rectangle, the ellipse tool. Well, there's this awesome little polygon tool. So if you click on it and then you click and drag to make a shape, it just starts to make a shape, right? And there's no real control over that. Let me show you two ways you can control the number of sides on your shape. First way is if I click and drag to start making this with my other hand, if I use my up and down arrow keys, it actually increases or decreases the number of sides of the shape that I'm making. So I can just use my arrow key to create something that's got a lot of uh, small sides or I can go back down to create some of the basic shapes like a triangle or a square or a pentagon, right? Hexagon, I always get those two mixed up. Anyway, and then you, all you have to do is let go and you've created your shape. Now the other way that's maybe a little bit <laughs> less keyboard intensive is just to use your polygon tool, click on your canvas, and it opens up the, uh, the little polygon dialog box. I can decide that I want to have eight sides on this shape, and I want the radius of this to be 250, and I can hit OK, and there it is. I've got an eight-sided uh, shape, maybe for a stop sign. A stop sign has eight sides, right? Well, at least in the US. That is how you create any number-sided shape in Adobe Illustrator. You can easily create triangles. It's actually my preferred method to create a triangle, an equilateral triangle. Uh, you can create squares or hexagons, pentagons, octagons, dodecahedrons. Those are spherical, aren't they? Maybe you can't make that. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you guys like this video, like this video, and uh, subscribe if you like any of my other videos. Uh, and I will see you guys next time.